American Idol finalist Abby Carter paid a visit to Washington Charter Elementary School this morning, which she attended as a young student here in the Valley and even listened to a performance today from the choir. We spoke with some of Abby's teachers about the kind of student and performer she has always been. Take a listen. Tell me about the first time you ever heard her sing. I was blown away. I mean, it was, she's just, she seems like an angel. Christina Osborne is a math teacher for Horizon High School. She says it was early on when she learned Abby was a great singer. An angelic voice complemented by an angelic heart. She's, just, she's a delight. She was always smiling, talking to every teacher. And then she would talk to the other kids. Um, a lot of kids at Horizon School aren't very outgoing. And she'd take kids kind of under her wing. Abby's third grade teacher, Sharon Rush, says Abby loved reading and her same childhood qualities can be recognized today. First of all, she was Abigail. Okay. That's who she is. She was Abigail. And when I saw her on the you know, American Idol, the first um, audition tape, I thought, that's the smile. That's the eyes that glow when she smiles. That's that whole face that lights up. She's the same little girl that I had in third grade. Rush has answered many questions about Abby in her classroom. Students wanting to know what she was like. As her melodies reach beyond her soaring notes Listen to, the wind blow. to the hearts of children. Happy, happy, happy. You can dream, but there's hard work involved. I have been a fan of American Idol my entire life. Dreaming along with hard work, determination. I've been telling myself since I was a kid when I got old enough, I would do it. That's a message that she's giving to all of these students that you can make your dreams come true. And finally, Three words that describe Abby. Caring, loving, and an outstanding.